January to June. We are great. Oh Lord. We are great. Oh Lord. For all you have done in our life. Hallelujah. We are great. Oh Lord. Heavenly Father, we thank you. We are grateful for who you are in our life. We give you glory. We give you honor. Thank you for the first half of this year that we completed successfully. We give you glory. Thank you for your mercy that endures forever in our life. It is by your mercy we are not consumed. By your grace, we swallow six months in victory. Thank you for your divine protection. Thank you for your provisions. And thank you for your preservation. We give you glory, we give you honor, we give you adoration. Without a sudden our Lord, without glorified, without magnified. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Greetings to you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. And happy new month to you and your family. I pray that this month shall be your month of celebration and perfection in the power of the name of Jesus. I pray that the second half of this year shall be better than the first half for you and your loved ones. In the name of Jesus. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory to God. We are standing by his grace. Thank you, Lord Jesus. It is another time with Pastor Bola. Time with the Almighty God. As every first Saturday of the month has been dedicated to prayer. Today, we are going to decree and declare into the month of July. What did I say? We are going to decree and declare into the month of July. The book of Job 22-28 says, Thou shalt also decree a thing, and it shall be established unto thee, and the light shall shine upon thy ways. Therefore, we are going to decree and declare into the month of July by this order of the word of God. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. By the order of this God's word, everything you decree today shall be established, and the light shall shine upon your life in the mighty name of Jesus. Whatever you bind today shall be bind in heaven. Whatever you lose today shall be lost in heaven. That is the word of God. Hallelujah. Amen. As you pray this prayer, God shall manifest his power and you shall have a testimony. I say you shall have a testimony. This month of July, you shall have a testimony. You shall testify to the goodness of God this month of completion. In the name of Jesus, tell yourself, it's my month of testimony. This month of completion, this month of perfection, I shall testify to the favor of God, to the goodness of God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Once again, I welcome you to your month of perfection and restoration. I want you to pray along with me. Amen, somebody. You will say, oh, merciful God. Thank you for bringing me into the seven months of the year and also the second half of this year. Thank you, my Lord, my God. Thank you for your loving kindness and tender mercy towards me and my family in the name of Jesus. Thank you for preserving my life and the life of my loved ones in Jesus' name. Amen. According to the Psalm 92, 4 and 5, we say, For thou, Lord, has made me glad through thy work. I will triumph in the work of their hand. Oh Lord, how great are their work. And their thoughts are very deep. Heavenly Father, receive all my praises today in the mighty name of Jesus. Give me the courses to continue to praise your name in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, thank you for all I was able to accomplish in the first half of this year by your grace. Amen, somebody. In the name of Jesus, I return all the glory back unto you. For it is your grace that made it possible for me to accomplish these things 
Thank you, Lord Jehovah. Thank you, my King. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. The book of Lamentation, 3.22 and 23 says, It is of the Lord's mercy that we are not consumed, because his compassion fail not. They are new every morning. Great is thy faithfulness. Our God is a faithful God. He's a compassionate God. He's a merciful God. There is no one like him. There is no other God beside him. Hallelujah, somebody. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for your unfailing mercy and compassion for me and my family. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness. Even though when I am not faithful, you are faithful to me. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, my Savior. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Psalm 138, verse 8 says, The Lord will perfect that which consigneth me. Thy mercy, O Lord, endureth forever. Forsake not the work of thy hand. Yes, we are work of his hand. Amen, somebody. He created us in his image. Hallelujah. You will say, Almighty God, this seven month of this year, let your hand of perfection rest mightily upon me. Let your hand of perfection rest mightily upon my family. In the name of Jesus, let your hand of perfection rest upon my business, upon my ministry, upon my children, upon my husband. In the name of Jesus, oh Lord of perfection, perfect all that concerns me and my family. In the mighty name of Jesus. This month of perfection, oh Lord my Father, perfect all that concerns me and my family. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my Father, let your hand of perfection strengthen every crooked part in my, before me. In the name of Jesus. My Father, my Father, let the part I daily walk in be smooth in the name of Jesus. Go before me and make all the crooked places straight in the powerful name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, lead me on the path of righteousness and holiness that my life shall bring glory and honor to your holy name. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, my Redeemer. Thank you, Lord Jesus. The book of Philippians 1.6 says, Be confident of this very thing. God wants you to be confident that he which has begun a good work in your life will perform it until the end of Christ, Jesus Christ. Amen. He is the one that begins the good work in you since January, and he shall complete it in the mighty name of Jesus. You will pray, oh Lord, my curator, seven represent completeness. This seventh month, Abba Father, release the grace of completion upon me, upon my family, in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, help me with everything I need, spiritually, financially, and physically to complete the project and plan I have for this year. In the mighty name of Jesus. My plan for this year shall be fulfilled in the powerful name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father, strengthen me, help me, and provide for me so I, I don't end with abandoned projects. In the mighty name of Jesus. Whatever my hands started in the, in the month of since January, I shall complete it in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Amen. I want you to declare and declare by the order of the word of God in Psalm 63, 1, which says, O oh God, thou art my God, highly will I seek thee, and my soul thirsteth for thee, my flesh longeth for thee, in a dry and thirsty land, where there is no water. Hallelujah. Amen. You will pray, O oh Lord my God, seven also represent the foundation of your word. This seven months, and for the rest of my life, fill me with hunger and thirst for your word. Hallelujah. Give me the grace. I want to know you more. I want to serve you more. I want to do your will in the mighty name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, remove whatever is taking the place of your word in my life and help me to daily feed on your word in the mighty name of Jesus. By the order of your word, in Joshua 1 8, we say when I meditate on your word, I shall be successful and I shall prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, give me the grace to meditate on your word daily to live your word in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be, so must it be, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. According to the book of Genesis 2, verses 2 and 3, it says, God rested from the work of creation. Also, in the book of Matthew 11, 
28 to 29. Jesus called upon all of us to come to him and he will give us rest from the burden of our lives. Hallelujah. You will pray, oh Lord my God, as you, you rested from your work of creation on the seventh day, this seventh month, take me into season of divine rest in the mighty name of Jesus. Give me rest in all areas of my life in the mighty name of Jesus. Give me rest from years of struggling and stumbling in the mighty name of Jesus. Give me rest from physical and emotional pain, emotional pain in the name of Jesus. Give me rest from carrying evil and every yokes and bodies in the mighty name of Jesus. Give me rest from oppression and every form of bondage in the powerful name of Jesus. Offer my children, my Lord, my God, give me rest in the mighty name of Jesus. Offer my marriage, Father, give me rest in the mighty name of Jesus. Concerning my head, oh Lord Jesus, give me rest in the mighty name of Jesus. Concerning my job, give me rest, oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Concerning my ministry, Father, give me rest in the name of Jesus. Concerning my business, Father, give me rest in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father, surround me with your rest. In the mighty name of Jesus. Define rest in all areas. Round about in the powerful name of Jesus. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Thank you, my heavenly Father. Amen. The book of Genesis 8, 4 says, And the hack rested in seven months. On the seventh day of the month, upon the mountain of Ararat. Oh, Lord, you will pray. Great Jehovah, as the ark of Noah came to a place of rest, in seven months. These seven months, take me, take my family, take my ministry, take my business, may take my career to a place of rest, away from every flood and water that wants to overwhelm me. In the mighty name of Jesus, I shall not be drowned in the water of affliction. In the mighty name of Jesus, by the authority that is in the name of Jesus, I shall come out victorious over every situation and challenges of my life. In the powerful name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. You will pray. According to the book of the Deuteronomy 28, 7, it says, The Lord shall cause their enemy that rise up against thee to be smooth before their face. They shall come out against thee one way and flee before thee seven ways. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. You will pray. Oh, God, my Father. The mighty man of war, this month, give me total victory and deliverance from my enemies in the mighty name of Jesus. Enemy of my progress, Father, deliver me from them in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, arise and fight my battle. Give me victory, give me victory in the mighty name of Jesus. Make me victorious in the powerful name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my God, arise and cause every enemy that rises against me to be defeated before me in the powerful name of Jesus. Oh Lord, as they come against me in one direction, make them flee before me seven different ways in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. Hallelujah. By the order of the word of God, in Joel 2, 25 to 26, which says, and I will restore to you the year that the locust has eaten the canker worm, the caterpillar, and the pl climber worm, my great army which I send among them. And ye shall eat in plenty, and be satisfied, and pray the name of the Lord your God, that I dealt wondrously with you, and my people shall never be ashamed. That is promise of God. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. I don't know. Say I receive that. In the name of Jesus, you will pray, Oh God of resurrection, Oh God of resurrection, Oh God of resurrection, arise and give me a sevenfold resurrection of every good things the enemy has stolen from me. In the mighty name of Jesus, restore them back in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, restore every blessing, what opportunity, anointing, fashion, and glory I have lost to enemy or to sin. In the mighty name of Jesus. My Father, my Creator, don't let me be ashamed in the mighty name of Jesus. Don't let me be ashamed in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen, somebody. Amen. In the book of Genesis 12, 3 to 2 to 3, God promised our forefather Abraham. He says, 
and that I will make thee great nation, and I will bless thee, and make thy name great, and thou shalt be a blessing, and I will bless them that bless thee, and curse him that curseth thee, and in, the, in thee shall all the family of the earth be blessed. You are a descendant of Abraham. Amen, somebody. God is talking to you. It is your portion. Hallelujah, somebody. Amen. I want you to pray. Oh, Lord, my God, release heaven for blessing upon me this month in the mighty name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, release the blessing of greatness upon me in the name of Jesus. God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, make my family, my ministry, my, my business, my career great in the mighty name of Jesus. Make me great round about in the name of Jesus. Bless me with the blessing of more than enough in the mighty name of Jesus. Let my maximum now be minimum in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The blessing that will make me lend to many and I shall not borrow in the powerful name of Jesus. Jehovah Raphael, bless me with good health. Bless me with long life in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, make me a blessing to my generation. Make my children a blessing to their generation in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, my God, let me not be an empty and wasted life in the mighty name of Jesus. Let me not live an empty and wasted life in the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, let my life have a positive impact on my family and people you bring my way in the mighty name of Jesus. Make me a blessing to others in the powerful name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, let my life be blessed and completely free from evil causes and of covenant in the name of Jesus. <coughs> my father, my father, let everyone that remember me and help me also enjoy your blessing in the name of Jesus. Help my helpers in the mighty name of Jesus. Let everyone that causes me experience your wrath in the powerful name of Jesus. Let them experience your wrath in the mighty name of Jesus. Because you say you will cause whoever caused me in the powerful name of Jesus. Mighty Jehovah, bless me and make me more than a conqueror over principality, forces of darkness, and every form of satanic opposition. In the powerful name of Jesus. Thank you, mighty Jehovah. Hallelujah. By the order of the book of Luke, 1, verse 37 says, With God, all things are possible. Amen. There is no impossibility in the account or in the dictionary of our God. You will pray, Oh God of possibility, at the end of this month, let me have seven four things to thank you, to bless you, to praise you, and worship you in the mighty name of Jesus. Make me do something great in my life that people will see that this is your hand in the mighty name of Jesus. Turn all my impossibility to possibility in the name of Jesus. Let me and my family experience your uncommon favor and mercy this month and beyond in the powerful name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord, for answering my prayer. I pray in the name of Jesus. Amen, amen, and amen. Be a blessing to others. Share this message. Like us on YouTube. Make a comment. Subscribe if you have not subscribed. God bless you richly. Amen.